This is the home screen of the TaxSlayer Pro Web software. And when you first log into the software as a preparer, this is what you'll likely see, plus or minus certain items. Now on the left-hand side of the screen, just to point out some important options, we've got our e-file opt-out form, just in case you end up having to paper file a return. We've got the refund calculator, in case you need to give a client a quick estimate on his or her return. You can enter basic info, but we'll go into more detail on the refund calculator in a subsequent video. This is the message center button. This is our office in mail. I need to send a message to the manager. I need to send a message to one of my co-workers or vice versa. They may need to communicate directly with me. Starting a new return. If a client comes in and he or she is a returning client, you can enter the social security number and basic personal information will pull forward. If he or she is a new client, you'll be asked if you wish to create a new return. Say yes and go about completing the return. There will be a lot more information to come on that subject in another video. Client search. This is for returns that already exist in the database. Going about locating them, making sure that they were processed and completed. Configuration. Once you enter in your company information at the beginning of the season, you can pretty much set it and forget it. The print check option is here as well as three prior years worth of software 2015, 2014, and 2013 and next year since we'll be doing 2017 returns these will change to 2016, 2015, and 2014. So that's the home screen in a nutshell. Be sure to watch the rest of the training videos dealing with TaxLayer ProWeb.